You've probably seen the pictures and wondered why a sports arena in Grant County. Developer Val Belmonte has been looking at the pictures and the building site a lot longer, and he says, why not? It was almost like the perfect storm. Everything came together. We had uh, a great administration, great leadership. We had great civic leaders in the community. Uh, we had a, a rich history of sports and entertainment in the area, and we just felt it was a, a perfect spot. The full name is the Marion Sports and Entertainment Center, home for minor league hockey, special athletic events, and many more entertainment choices all new to Grant County. In fact, about three-fourths of the events here won't be on ice, so the complex will change to different floor plans for concerts, specialty shows, even a little basketball. Lots of variety and lots of choices to bring visitors here from out of town. It helps to think of this project as something not just for Marion, but impacting the entire I-69 corridor. Thousands pass this road every day. Many could come from as far away as Anderson, Bluffton, Huntington, and lots of other areas just to see something special over here in Grant County. It's already a busy spot that's seen more development in the last five years, from new industry to businesses, and soon apartment living within walking distance of the arena. Belmonte says the center will be part of the community, and he says the key to success will be leaders who don't just build it and go. Well, building the building is just, just part of the project. The other part of the project is making sure that you have a, a good promotion and marketing uh, arm of your organization. You have a good, you have a good product. So we're going to call it driveway to driveway. It's, it's our responsibility to make it a great driveway to driveway experience. And one other thing that helped developers see a field that could be filled with fans. The response of Grant County's leaders. They're dynamic. They think outside the box. They have a great passion for their town. There's enough people in this community that want to make it work. Yes, there's a lot of people that might say, we don't deserve a facility like this, or why do they want to come here? And my feeling is, why not? Uh, if you don't take a calculated risk in, our, in this country, you're not going to go anywhere. And I think your children and your community are worth it. So look for this field to be a little busier in the months ahead. And by July of next year, a whole new look for thousands of passing motorists and potentially years of great entertainment for local families looking for a new kind of fun.